I have this relationship with painting that is kind of, I'm a, I'm a kind of an acolyte of, 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 uh, of, of this church that is painting and I have to, to pray every day. So I, I come here as a worker, do my stuff. And I have this commitment with the, with the surface, with the, the, the materials. That's, that's, this is the practical stuff that I, that I know the rest of it. The moment that, that the image happens, I don't know nothing. So uh, at, at first, one thing I have to know <laughs> that I feel actually is, uh, is, is the, 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 the doing, the, the practice of every day. So I, I, think, I think myself as a worker. My artistic style is something that I still don't know, actually, because uh, the mo the, the, most of my, my practice is about uh, understand why things move me. Uh, it's understand why, why things make me feel emotional about this. And, and most of them, it's like the things that I, it's, it's about the things that I saw once. I, and I understand that it's not about a type of image that I, what, what I'm doing, it's about something that I can reach in between actual image and something that I never saw before. When we work with paint, we carry with us a whole history of it. Even if we want or not, we are, t we are talking about the heritage of painting. Is it the, the language that has most heritage, invisible heritage that you can see. When you see a painting, you understand that it passed through a long time. To, and it, why is this this way? So, uh, since my work is about heritage, I understand that I have to, to look after this stuff. I can say that part, part of my work is still very social. I, I'm very influenced by my, uh, my surroundings. At first, I, uh, I understand like the scale and and the and the architecture as a subject of my work, and then that just don't doesn't make sense anymore. And then I understand the city and the and the cityscapes, uh, and then this subject was kind of enough for me. And then I wa I went further and discovered the, the, the landscape and discovered the landscape as a as a very formal and uh, analytic situation but then I discovered that what inter what was interesting to me actually was the um, affective and emotionally thing about the landscape so it kept changing and my work uh, go with me on that you know so uh, right now I can understand that I that my I, I'm a painter and I and I, I and I paint kind of a landscapes I work a lot in education and then in education I understand the, the purpose of art being shown and, be, and, and the purpose of art to come uh, to different persons because it, it comes to be alive when p different people see it and have a relationship with it, even they, if they are from completely different places from the, the original piece. 